Hey y'all, we are back. I just wanted to show you this out here. Uh, what I did is um, I took the X-Acto, like I showed you in that other video, because it's clear coat, and uh, put a, a scribe line or a cut line in the clear coat uh, with the, you know, I had the, the tape, the masking on it still, just inside the, uh, the line that was on here. And then uh, went ahead with the, with the cut off wheel and, and cut as many spots as we could. Um, and you don't need to make one big continuous cut. You can just do, that way it doesn't catch and take off on you like it did right here. I was real close there to going past, but uh, you know, I'm a professional. So uh, this is a um, fiberglass burr, um, not a rotary file, not a <laughs> sanding uh, barrel sander or something. Barrel sanders would work too. Uh, Tootsie roll, not so much because they kind of hop and bounce a little bit because the, 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 uh, sandpaper is actually folded over, rolled around on those. But you see the piece of clear coat that came off as I was coming down. It comes right up to where you put that little razor blade cut in there. So this is just a rough, rough look. Um, yeah, how this thing fits. How did we do? And uh, look, not too bad. Uh, we'll go ahead and clean that up with that file there. It's a uh, half round. Um, We'll go ahead and uh, smooth the edges up a little bit. We won't go 10 tenths with it, but we'll get it real close so we know where this thing is going to sit. And uh, you know, we've glued those three pieces that I showed you in the other video together. So now what we'll do is we'll go from the end of those three pieces. We'll start at this end and connect the two. And, uh, and that's it. That's what we're doing. We're, uh, we're playing out here with the fiberglass, getting, trying to get it done. Talk to you all soon.